Eyewitness News is your vaccine authority. While many across the state are eager to get vaccinated, others are skeptical. So there's a big push to educate more people on the benefits of getting vaccinated. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Aya Galal is live now right outside Bristol Hospital this morning. Aya, how are healthcare workers trying to reach out to the community? Nicole and Wendell, they are taking several different approaches. We know that Bristol Health has been holding various events that can help people navigate registering for a COVID-19 vaccine appointment. Bristol Health staff have also been walking around the community, going to local businesses, handing out pamphlets that educate people on the benefits of getting vaccinated. All of this in hopes of combating vaccine hesitancy. Our mission is really to get as many eligible recipients an appointment as soon as possible so we get them vaccinated as early as possible. And that's why Bristol Health teamed up with the Bristol NAACP for a vaccine registration event Wednesday night. Just show up if you're eligible and a volunteer will help you register for a vaccine appointment. But not many people came to the event. Data released by the state shows smaller percentages of black and brown communities are getting vaccinated compared with white populations. The medical community, I think, has our best interest at heart. Let's trust the medical data here. Community officials are working tirelessly to get the word out that the vaccine is safe. Earlier this week, Bristol Health staff walked around local businesses handing out pamphlets explaining in English and Spanish how people can get vaccinated. And so volunteers and staff plan to continue fighting vaccine hesitancy especially within communities of color and plans are also in place for mobile vaccine clinics. Live in Bristol this morning, Aya Galal, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.